We want to keep you updated on this breaking story that we've been following all morning. Milwaukee firefighters investigating what they're calling a suspicious fire at an apartment complex. Our Lauren Winfrey joins us live with more on a difficult morning for the people who live there. Hi, Lauren. It admits it was quite a difficult morning for those people, but many of those who were standing out on the streets are now at least in a bus, and so they're a little bit warmer. There's not much to see out here now, just a couple of crews left, but we can give you a look at what things looked like just moments ago. We spoke with the deputy fire chief, and he says that three separate apartment buildings caught fire, and he described those buildings as deep 16 family apartments. Now, once crews arrived, the deputy chief says there were reports of people being trapped inside, and that's when firefighters went into rescue mode. They had to pull one person out by ladder and the other person they were able to walk out of the building. We're told that although uh, there were uh, three people who sustained injuries, they were minor and they appear to be in decent condition. Now, I did speak with a resident who described what he saw and heard just moments before the building erupted into flames. Next you know, the smoke detectors went off. So I opened the door and I see the hallway full of smoke. So I started knocking on doors, telling people to get out. You know what I'm saying? It came down, got, grabbed some kids out. I said, I got blood all on my hand. Now the deputy fire chief says because crews found three separate fires, they are investigating this as suspicious. And not only this, not only that, that is the second fire to happen at one of these buildings in just a matter of days. So these crews have been working very hard in this area. But for now, reporting at 39th and Hopkins, Lauren Winfrey, today's TMJ4. All right, Lauren, thank you very much.